so while we're demoing our little group activity is collage and there's those clippings in front of you some fabric be looking through the clippings or the magazines to find things that you think invoke like your sense of self for a portrait and if you don't want to do yourself you can do like maybe an important woman in your life because ours is mainly focused on women in art and media. <laughs> Let me know when y'all have like one piece of paper like to glue down or a gear. Does everyone have one piece? <laughs> That's okay. This is a demo. That's okay. It's just practice. It's just practice. Okay. So you're gonna get your paintbrush and you're kind of just kind of trying to paint the glue out to flatten it out. I don't know if you guys can see. 
Because we don't want it to be clumpy or anything when it's uh, pressed down onto the paper. Unless you like that, I don't know. Mm -hmm. Unless you like some clumpy glue. Is everyone following along with putting down glue? Yes. Awesome. Okay. So I have my glue on the back. Maybe won't show you for too long so it doesn't blow up. And we're just going to put it down on the paper. I already have air bubbles. That's okay though. Just smooth it out. We're going to get a piece of paper towel. Just move it out with our fingers. Okay, and then if you didn't get some edges like I did it, you can go back with your uh, <laughs> with your paintbrush and put some glue on the edges and then uh, pat it back down with your paper towel. but I don't feel like it, I'm going to be honest. <laughs> um, and then typically, uh, in order for the paper to stay flat and down, you would put it under some uh, flat and heavy, uh, I don't know, books, magazines, uh, to flatten it down for a couple days. So you would want to do this in advance before the project is due. Ideally. Ideally. <laughs> For you, do you? As long as I don't see it. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Also remember, it doesn't have to be like a figural portrait. You can just do things that you think represents yourself, or you could make yourself on little clippings if that's what you want to do. Japanese paper, it'll spin pieces. You could draw something on it, cut it out, and basically do the same thing. Um, put kind of paint the glue on the back and smooth it out with your paper towel. You can also draw as well with your, instead of just doing the clippings, you can draw on top of them, draw with them. If anyone needs markers, you can raise your hand, I'll get you some. We're going to move on to fabric. I've tossed out some fabric for everyone. Um, and basically, we're just going to 
stitch the fabric into the paper.